Susie Lee Kilgariff, Northern Light Marketing Communications. If you have an audience that you want to communicate with, then we will help you, first of all, refine that message, and secondly, actually get it out there. So whether it's um, doing it through your brand, the values you want to convey, online, through your website, sales brochures, anything really, that's what we do. I'd put it down to the quality of our thinking, actually. Um, without meaning to cast aspersions on my fellow colleagues, there's a few grey hairs amongst us. And I think that experience and the quality of thinking gives us the edge. I'm a big girl's blouse, Earl Grey. <laughs> Every time we've scored a really big success for a client, we have actually danced up and down the office. So we had um, one website where after a year of, Im of implementation, we saw that traffic numbers had increased by, I think it was 161%. That got a dance. We've had email open rates go through the roof for a client. Um, every time that happens, it's great. If you want, uh, I think, really good accountants who are proactive, then I'd recommend Pinnacle in Salford Keys. Um, if you're in the recruitment industry and you're a specialist in information technology, um, information management, then I would recommend KDR Recruitment, they're great. And at the risk of putting ourselves out of a job, I really rate Marketecture, who are a B2B um, marketing communications agency. They really know their stuff. I think the most influential people in Manchester are Dame Nancy Rothwell, who is the president of Manchester University. That's a lot of student minds that she's responsible for, and the first woman in the position. I also think Caroline Shaw is massively influential, possibly not for the reasons we'd like her to be, but um, I think so many people in Manchester are touched by the Christie, so what they do there is amazing. And thirdly, I'm going to say um, Brian Cox, because I think he's made physics cool and he's absolutely associated with Manchester. And if that's what we're known for, rather than just the music and football, then great. The two nicest people that I've come across are Rachel Cummins at McCann Erickson and Rachel Taylor, who works at the Market Family. Um, they're people I've worked with years ago who've just become my best friends. Um, and the other really lovely person that I've had the fortune to work with is Matt Tyson, who's the MD of Pinnacle. Thoroughly decent bloke. First of all, ignore everybody who says, just give it about 90%, that'll do the extra 10%, doesn't make any difference. They're lying. Um, always do the absolute best you can, I think. Um, Secondly, I think everybody makes mistakes, um, but it's how you learn from them that separates whether you'll succeed in life. And finally, I think you have to have a sense of humour and make work fun, otherwise what's the point? Oh, I've staggered out of Elwyn Con a few too many times, so I'll say Elwyn Con. I've only been to a handful of networking events and I've found that they uh, tend to be full of other suppliers. So my advice would be to, number one, get a job at McCann Erickson because that's the most amazing network you'll ever find. Or number two, use LinkedIn or just get out there and meet people without using networking events. <laughs>